Hey there, young geometry geniuses. Welcome back to our channel for a super fun geometry quiz. Ready to tackle some shapes and angles? Let's jump right in. Number one. What is the name of a polygon with four sides? The answer is letter B, quadrilateral. Number two. What is the name of a three-dimensional shape that has six square faces? The answer is letter A cube. Number three. What is the measure of an angle that is smaller than a right angle? The answer is letter D, acute angle. Number four. What is the name of a line that divides a circle into two equal parts? The answer is letter B, diameter. Number five. What is the formula for finding the area of a rectangle? The answer is letter B length times width. Number six. What is the name of a four-sided shape that has two pairs of parallel sides? The answer is letter D, parallelogram. Number seven. What is the name of a point where two or more lines meet? The answer is letter A, vertex. Number eight. What is the name of a line that touches a circle at exactly one point? The answer is letter B, tangent. Number nine. What is the name of a polygon with eight sides? The answer is letter D, octagon. Number 10. What is the name of a three-dimensional shape that has one circular base and one vertex? The answer is letter A, cone. Number 11. What is the measure of an angle that is equal to 90 degrees? The answer is letter C, right angle. Number 12. What is the name of a line segment that joins the center of a circle to any point on the circle? The answer is letter D, radius. Number 13. What is the formula for finding the perimeter of a square? The answer is letter A, four times side. Number 14. What is the name of a three-dimensional shape that has two circular bases and a curved surface? The answer is letter B, cylinder. Lastly, what is the name of a three-dimensional shape that has no faces edges or vertices? The answer is letter D, sphere. That's a wrap, geometry stars. Hope you enjoyed the quiz and learned something new. If you did, give us a thumbs up. Stay tuned for more math fun. Until next time, keep calculating!